into the replay now. It's the last game in the first round, the last game into the second round draw to be decided here. Road Maidenhead, a ground that links the ancient and the modern in the cup in a way that not even Wembley can. 144 years ago this month, the first ever batch of ties in the inaugural FA Cup included a game played here. Referee Dean Whitestone picking his way across the rather treacherous area of This game keenly anticipated for the past 11 days since that 94th minute equaliser. Suit character in goal. In the third round, all the other magpies of Newcastle last season. Upward. Peters. Pretty well to keep that alive. Goalkeeper has caught in no man's land. Right was closing in. Just seem to stand and watch. Forward for this. Oh, a better delivery. Pritchard. Left by Tarpey. Ben right. And right still. Struck McGibbon. And then Alec with the save. With the save. With the save. Beautifully, crisply struck by the skipper. Alan Massey scores his first goal for Maidenhead United, and what a time to choose! Maidenhead celebrity fan with his own <laughs> makeup, which he was brandishing in the bar beforehand, rather like a, a trophy that. Milton's side was capable of actually winning. Now, Milton Peters, who works as a coach in Brentford's Academy. Okay, so see you later. It's brilliant scores, different Ryan Peters. Ends at half time. Habit of a lifetime. You need to make the head to get that early goal, and they certainly got that. They played on the front foot, they're playing in the right areas, they're playing the ball out wide. Just the same. Pritchard. It's too much physical contact with the referees, like he spotted a push. It's contested by Maidenhead, in particular by Dean Inman, so his shirt was being pulled. It's not just the teams that have switched ends, so has Timmy Mallet. I used my gag up in the first half, so it don't go there again. Head's run in the FA Cup began at the second qualifying round stage. That's pleasant to see a draw at Winchester City. Oh, that was a really good chance. Perhaps not quite enough of them. Pritchard had taken that lead. Had an opportunity with five minutes to go. And who knows? Port Vale, the winners, York Road, by three goals to one. 